Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. So, we're in a new space. No, I did not move. I'm just in a different part of my house. We're in my little, I guess, library area. So, I'll give you more details about that. So, we're going to do like a quick makeup tutorial. I was supposed to film this earlier today, but time got away from me. So, without further ado, let's jump into the video and zoom you guys closer. Right, so now that you guys are zoomed in closer, let's get started with the makeup. So I'm going to take my Smashbox Photo Finish Primer. I'm just going to prime my face. So the reason why I'm in my little library area is because we're cleaning it. My brother's moving back home. So my dad and I need to move out of his room. And I was using his room as like a laundry room type room so we decided to clean out the bar library area for my dad and i to do our thing and i had my desk just sitting in the middle of our room and that's where most of my videos are filmed as you can see and yeah we just moved my desk in here and now this will be my new filming space i might decorate the wall a little bit but we'll see. I'm not too confident about that. All right, so for foundation, I'm gonna be taking my Maybelline Superstay Full Coverage Foundation in the color Toffee Caramel. I think when I was talking about this in, don't remember which video it was, but I think I mispronounced the name of the foundation. So I try not to miss I was trying to make sure I didn't mispronounce it this time. So how has everybody been? How's everyone's December? I hope you guys are liking the videos I've been putting out. I feel like I ask that question all the time. But if you have any video suggestions, leave them down below. If not, we're just gonna be doing mostly makeup tutorials and probably unboxings of packages I get. Also, let me know if you want me to do like a what I got for Christmas video. And if you do, I'll just post that next Saturday and not the video I do have planned. So, blending this down my neck. I did get a new drugstore, two new drugstore foundations. I'm going to do a video about them probably in the next few weeks. Just me talking about them, like the ones I got. I did get them from Ulta, so it'll be like a mini what I got from Ulta. I'm using Tarte Shape Tape in medium. And I'm putting that under my eyes. I was watching a... Is it a TikTok? Yeah, it was a TikTok. And this guy was like, don't do the triangle underneath your eye, which you guys need to see. I started doing the triangle. But he said just do like two, like two little lines underneath the eye. And that will help. Oh, let me wet this real quick. Was saying don't do the triangle underneath your eye because it will start to emphasize like your cheek area and you don't want that you just want it to lift your eye so we'll see how this turns out yeah that looks a lot better so yeah i'm still playing around with the setup of this whole room and how I want my filming space to look. And this mirror is hecka dirty. What's, what's new? What's new with my look? All right, so we're going to contour with my Uma Beauty contour, double take sculpt and stroke contour stick in the color Honey Honey, which is number three. And we're just going to do dots 
around my face. And you might contour my nose. Oh, we will contour my nose. <laughs> Gotta make sure I do two straight. It's fine. Uh, there we go, that's a lot better. So just contouring my nose and we'll take my, first we'll contour my cheeks with this contour brush from Morphe and Jaclyn Hill. And excuse my hair guys, I'm trying some new hair products that I wanna see will work with my, my hair. My hair is less frizzy, so I think it's working. I've been following Bianca Renee's um, advice and different product recommendations, so I'm extremely happy about that. Wow, this mirror is really, I have like this little heart shaped mirror. I think I mentioned it to you guys in another video, but it's so dirty. I didn't realize how dirty it was. I need to clean that. I just need to clean my room. Cause there's a lot of stuff in there that just, I wasn't expecting to be there. All right, to set my under eyes, I'm taking my RCA Manual Color Translucent Powder. I'm taking it on my e.l.f. sponge. I'm gonna put that underneath my eyes. But then for the rest of my face, I'm going to be taking this Too Faced Born This Way Multi Complexion Powder. I'm gonna call it Natural Beige. So it looks like this. And because my foundation is a little darker than my Skin, we'll see if this will help, you know, balance it all out without hitting my contour area. I forgot how matte this foundation is. I mean, I know it says matte in the, the name, but I didn't think it was like matte matte, you know? All right, for bronzer. Do I need to say which bronzer I'm using? It's the same one I've been using for the past month or so. Opening at by ColourPop. Honestly, I don't know if they still have this bronzer because ColourPop always has different collections going on and not a lot of their products stay in stock slash are available. So if this bronzer is not available, I'll try to list um, some other bronzers that I use from them. And then let's dust off this fake. I'm just knocking everything over. Not bad. All right. For blush, I'm going to be using NARS Orgasm. And I don't know if I've told you about this particular blush, but, but when I got it, it just wasn't working. Like the color wasn't picking up or whatever. And it's taken me a long time for it to actually pick up. So hopefully today it will be on its best behavior. There we go. That's new. I know there's some like bumps on my face. Hmm. I don't know, my skin's been acting weird. I don't know if it's my uh, cleanser I'm using or what, but it wasn't happy with me. I mean, it's getting a little better, but it's not like all over the top. All right, I'm gonna now take my Smashbox Spotlight Palette in the 
color gold and I'm gonna take this color right here it's called blow up fuse and I am going to take it on my highlighter brush or do I want to blow up fuse or do I want we'll do a mixture of blow we'll do a mixture of this one which is turn it up gold and blow a fuse and see how that works cute all righty so that's the face i'm going to turn off the camera and do my brows because let's face it, it takes me a long time to do my brows and i want to focus on the eyes and not my brows so let me turn you guys off and i'll be not turn you guys off i'll just see you in three two one god i need to see kayla soon because my eyebrows look like trash she did message me today saying that she's going to be taking clients soon which thank god because i need help all right so we are let me prime my eyes with my urban decay all night or er, urban decay eyeshadow primer potion i don't know why i keep trying to say all nighter setting spray which if you guys haven't tried it you should also i was thinking of falling like doing that jackie Ina mask tutorial and like not mask like make mask makeup tutorial so if you guys want me to do that let me know in the comments below um i mean i still might do it because i really want to see if it works people say it works and i saw someone do the whole mask thing without um that ben nye spray that she got so i'm excited all right so let me do that all right so we're gonna be taking my it's all good palette and now that i have my desk and you guys are a little bit farther away i can actually hold up the colors and you guys can see which one i'm pointing to which let me tell you that's amazing so to start i think we're gonna i'm gonna take this color right here which is called good vibes i'm gonna pick it up and put that in my crease and yes i know when i picked it up my palette the first time it was busted I think this look is going to turn out a little pinky, but it's okay. We'll make it work. Next, I'm going to pick up on this brush right here. This dark color, which is called Rock Sugar. I'm going to take it on this brush and I'm going to put it on my outer V. Just to darken it up a little bit. Also, let me apologize. That was a lot. I wanted to apologize about my um, tar excuse me, the Target video I posted because I know I posted it at midnight and not a lot of people saw it. Apologize. I had a late upload because Sunday my little cousin turned 19. And I wanted to drop off her presents to her. And I didn't know that her sister, who came from Hawaii, was going to be in town. So we had dinner and talked. And, you know, it was good to see him because I haven't seen my cousin who was in Hawaii in a while. Maybe since summer. Okay, that's what the eyes are looking. Let me put a little bit of good vibes so I don't lose that color in the crease. Just to clean it. I think this might turn a little bit more purpley, which I'm not mad at because I haven't done a purple look before yet. Have I? No, I don't think I have. Don't think I've done a purple look. 
All right, so now I'm going to pick up this color right here. It's called Concierge. It's like a pinky purple color. I'm gonna take that on like this brush right here. It's like a flat type brush. I'm gonna put it all over my lid. Oh yeah, that's pretty. That is so pretty. Yeah, it's more pinky purpley. And yes, guys, I am gonna be opening up my advent calendar, so stay tuned to watch it. And if you actually watch my advent calendar opening, leave a sock emoji. Yeah, leave a sock emoji down below so I know that you guys actually watch my videos all the way through. And then I think on the other side of the brush, I'm gonna pick up this color right here. It's called Vibes. As you can see, I love that color. It has a very nice dent in it. So I'm going to pick it up and just lightly go over the top just to make it a little bit more brown. And then we'll go back over with concierge again. just so it can have like the more purpley effect to look that I'm going for. Again, back with good vibes. And we're just going to blend that in. Ooh, cute. All right, for my lower lash line, I'm gonna take vibes. I'm probably mixed, yeah, I'm gonna take vibes and just put that down below. I need to start wearing makeup to work, but I don't want to scare people. So, yeah. All right, for my mascara, I'm taking my Laura Mercier Volume Caviar Mascara. Yeah, I'll we'll take it on. All right, and then for my lower lash line, I'm gonna take my MAC Extended Giga Black Lash Mascara. And I like this one on my lower lash line because as you can see, it has a smaller layer of bristles, not smaller wand. It's better to grab onto my lower lash line. Now for my lips, I'm going to be taking the, the Love Spell Lip Matte Crayon from Ulta and Harry Potter and just put it on my lips. Honestly, that actually matches the color my eye color i did really well at picking this all right now it's time for the fun part my sock unboxing so we have two more days left of my eat drink and be merry so let's open it up so the second to last day is this coffee mug and inside Like it are all these little <laughs> it's these little black uh short socks that says why not wine not that's cute and then the last day it says 
always merry which is day 15 and it has some gingerbreads on it and oh it has that long pair of socks yes let's taco about it on that little taco on it that's cute and now we're gonna open up my nightmare before christmas one so let's hope these one Oh crap, I broke my nail. And I can't go to the nail salon. Great. Well, let's just get to it. Look how sad that is. Now I have to put a band-aid on. And we have only a few more weeks until we open back up. So I'm gonna open up day one, right? Let's not show that nail. We're gonna open up day one, which is just Sally and Jack. Oh, this one is open, easy to open, thank God. And this one says, oh, these ones actually jump around. Yes, these ones jump around, so I actually have to find where each one of them is. So, oh, it's Oogie Boogie. So that's really cute. Huh. That's great. Maybe I can just paint it. I don't know. We'll see. All right. Now for my Harry Potter crest one. We have this little uh, goblet right here. I think this is the exact same goblet that Harry and them had to put their name, the Goblet of Fire. So this is where they had to put their names in for the Triwizard Tournament. And Fred and George tried to put their names in, but they weren't of age. And, oh, their little Pegasi. That's cute. Next we have the little Pixies. If you've seen Harry Potter in the Chamber of Secrets? Yeah, Gildory Lockhart brings these pixies in to um, the Defense Against Dark Arts class for the kids to fight against. And it was not good. <laughs> Cornish pixies. So that's cute. And the last one is Ravenclaw. So let's open her up. I think I'm gonna give this one to my cousin as well since I'm not a Ravenclaw. So she can get two socks. Aww. And they're just the little Ravenclaw um, mascot emblem. So that's it for tonight's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Don't forget to like subscribe and hit that notification bell so you don't miss out on any of my other videos if you have any video suggestions don't forget to leave a comment down below and i'll see you in the next one bye guys